we need resources for most things that make our lives easier and happier, like stylish interiors, fashionable clothes, or smartphones. At the end of the product's life, we tend to be careless and quickly get rid of it, resulting in an ever-increasing waste and resource problem. However, taking a closer look at the things we throw away reveals they consist of valuable ingredients. What is a potential solution to this overconsumption, and how can nature serve as inspiration for preventing waste? In nature, everything follows its own life cycle. Take an apple tree, for instance. It blossoms, it bears fruit, which falls to the ground, decomposes, and returns nutrients to the roots that help the tree to grow new apples. But we humans act as if natural resources were infinitely available on Earth. We extract the resources, manufacture a product, and dispose of it after use. Take, make, waste, from cradle to grave. If we turn this linear model into a more circular one, like the tree, we can minimize waste and save raw materials. The circular model forms the basis for the cradle-to-cradle -cradle design concept. Here, Products are designed and manufactured with the aim of using their components in the end-of-life phase to create new products, thereby keeping material flowing in recycling loops. The according concept, the cradle-to-cradle -cradle design concept, was developed by Professor Michael Braungart and William McDonough. Their concept offers a framework for designing sustainable, intelligent products, processes, and systems by taking the entire life cycle into account. Due to the different composition of various products and materials, we differentiate between biological and technical cycles. The biological cycle includes everything that wears out in our environment. The technological cycle comprises service products, such as faucets. These products need to be broken down into their original components to make new products. But what has this got to do with GROW? We are one of the first leading brands in the sanitary industry to launch cradle-to-cradle -cradle certified products. Four of our GROW products are designed and manufactured in such a way that they can be returned to the production cycle to make new fittings. To assess if our products are eligible for cradle-to-cradle -cradle certification, all of them were evaluated against five categories. Material health, material reutilization, renewable energy, water stewardship, and social fairness. Each product was then designated a level of achievement from bronze to platinum. We achieved the gold level with all four products. The GROW Research Laboratory in Hammer, Germany played an important part here as they had to optimize all product materials regarding their material health and material reutilization. Even though fittings have a long service life, we still want to enable installers, architects, planners, and consumers to return their cradle-to-cradle -cradle products after the end of use. With this cradle-to-cradle -cradle certification, we at GROW have taken a decisive step on our path toward a circular economy, saving valuable resources. About 50% of worldwide material consumption is accounted for by the building sector, making this a highly urgent matter. We are therefore also supporting the advancement towards more sustainable buildings with our cradle-to-cradle -cradle certified products. In this way, we can help clean up our planet and ensure enough resources for generations to come.